patient is supine this is the fracture hand you can put like this now this neck is uh, tilted to the other side this side okay then the lamb nuts are two head of sternocleidomaster this is the sternal head and this is the clavicular head okay so this is the sternal head this is the clavicular head okay this is the thyroid cartilage and this is the cricket cartilage okay you roll over your hand fingers like this you will feel a groove at the lateral part of sternocleidomastoid muscle that is not the groove that is the not this is not the intestinal groove okay come further lateral you will feel a groove in between the anterosclerotic and the middle scan. This is the interscreen group. So it will act on the C5, which is at the proper record cartilage to the base of the clavicle. You, you can put the needle according to the site of the surgery. You can put the needle here, okay, at the level of the uh, roots for shoulder and clavicular surgery. And just above the uh, clavicle, that is 2 cm above the clavicle, you can put the needle for mid arm and elbow surgeries and for the uh, uh, in the base and just above the clavicle will for the distal surgery like forearm surgery and wrist surgeries and all. So how will you identify the intestinal group? Ask the patient again lift, okay? Then you feel the group here and ask the patient to sniff. Now your group is prominent. <coughs> Now my finger is indenting over the groove when the patient sniffs. So this is the point of needle insertions. Okay? And the advantage of this technique is that the lung pleura lies here. Here the, this is the pleural dome of pleura. Okay? So we are clearly almost 1.5 to 2 centimeters lateral to the uh, this is dome of pleura. So there is no chance of pneumothorax at all. Second thing, uh, in, the, in the very obvious also, this interscreening group is palpable. It is quite palpable. It is, he is an 80 kg, still it is very nicely palpable. So in the obvious also, and in, the, in, in this interscreening group, this brachial plugs are sandwiched. Okay? And you are giving at the level of the trunk. It is the most compact part. So, uh, any contraction, can be assumed as an end motor response. Contraction from pectoralis major, the de uh, deltoid, triceps, biceps, forearm movement, wrist movement can be uh, taken as an end motor response if you are getting S as at 0.5 milliamps of current. And in the ob obvious also, we have seen that we should not go beyond 3.5 centimeters from the skin point because usually this is the lung pleura. So from here, if you want to hit the pleura, you have to go around 3.8 to 4 centimeters from the skin point. So it is advisable, even in the obese, do not go beyond 3.5 centimeters from the skin point. <coughs> if you are not, not getting the contraction, then you redirect your needle, reassess your anatomies. Okay? Now, we will go for injection technique. A 50 mm needle, stimuplex needle, this is flushed with local anesthetics. So as the surgery is here, here mid arm, will go here, injection point, that is above, uh, at least 2 centimeters above the clavicles. Okay? Basically, this way.
So this is the current. You see? This. So we are not getting the contraction anymore. See? See? No contraction at 0.37 means you are not interneuronal. Now we increase the current. So we are getting the current. That indicates we are not in intraneuronal positions. Okay, you are in the correct position, you are getting the contraction of factorial measure, deltoid, uh, some uh, uh, biceps and the triceps also, you can uh, aspirate and inject. In the local, local anesthetic in the hub, you see, after 20 ml of local anesthetic. See, it is in the positions, the block will definitely work. Okay. Mobile the Kadis. Hat to Palladium? Palladium. Pus? Pus? Nine. Pus? Nine. I'm getting an acro. So Pus is gone. So Redil is gone. See? Pusadio had to pull a palladio. And I go Pusadio? Pusadio? So pull is gone. Muscular fitness gone. Pins, pins. Gompase? Gompona? So he's not feeling. Any sensation? Pins for median? Why say? Nine. So pull is, go, uh, pull is gone for radial. Oh, sorry, push is gone for radial. Pull is gone for muscular fitness. Pins for med for ulnar is gone. Everything is gone. Are you done? Any side? Nine. Hey, So this limb is anesthetized. So you can go for surgery anytime. So this is a block assessment at exactly at uh, 40 minutes. Now, okay, we see my